Hello everyone. You're welcome to FUCO Mathematics. Here we provide a solution to mathematical equations. And um, here is what we have to deal with. We have 10 to the power of x plus 10 to the power of x plus 10 to the power of x equals 600. Now, what do you think will be the first step? Is to add the left hand side. And we can do that by factorization, right? Because 10 to the power of x is common. Then here we'll have 1 plus 1 plus 1. If you open this bracket, it will give you this back. So this is now equal to 600. Now, what again can I do? This is 10 to the power of x into 3 equals 600. Now, we will divide this by 3 and divide this by 3. This can go. Now, 10 to the power of x is equal to 200. Now, the question is what again can we do? We are going to take the log of both sides. So we have 10, I mean log 10 to the power of x equals log 200. But then, remember this law, we call it the power law. Power law of logarithm. Okay, so the power law of logarithm says that if you have log a to the power of b, this is the same thing as b log a. And then this right here is in this form. So I will write this in this form so that x comes here and I have log 10. And this is equal to, um, what do I have? I have log 200. Okay. Now, since we are looking for the value of x, it is only right that we divide this by log 10, then divide this by log of 10. Now, this will go with this. That way, x will be equal to log 200 over log 10. Okay, so now we can equally, you know, um, simplify what we have here. But then remember that log 10, do you know that log 10 is the same as 1? Okay, because this is log 10 to base 10. So if that is the case, then our x will be equal to log 200, and this is divided by 1. When you divide any number by 1, it gives you the same number. So we have log 200. This is the value of x. Okay, but like we always do, we always um, verify our answer. But if I want, I can write this as log 200 to be 10. This is natural logarithm. Now, let us verify. Okay, verification stage. Now, we had um, 10 to the power of x plus 10 to the power of x plus 10 to the power of x equals 600. Now, we are going to have 10 to the power of log 200. And I told you log 200 is the same as log 200 to be 10, right? And then, plus 10 to the power of log 200 to be 10 plus... Okay, so we have another 10 to the power of log 200 to base 10. This is supposed to be 600. Okay, that is 600. Now, since we have log 200 to base 10 and this 10, we'll have only 200 over there. Then plus the same, this and this can go, so we have 200. Then plus the same 200 over there. 
and 200 plus 200 is 400 plus 200 is 600 okay so we are very sure that x is truly equal to log 200 and this is to be 10. thank you for watching